Okay, so I've had this hair in for two and a half weeks. It's about to be three weeks. And this is like my review on this hair, how I feel about this hair. Will I order it again? Heck yeah. I am here to talk to you about my yi or me yi hair. Is it my yi? My yi? Me yi? Me yi hair. Oh my god. But you know how you say something in your head and then you have to say it out loud and now you don't know how it's really supposed to be? So I decided to, I wanted color in my hair, but I was very scared of actually damaging my real hair. I've seen lots of naturals, my similar um, hair texture, they have um, dye their hair, bleach their hair, and it turns out fine. But it would be me. I would be the person that I would dye or bleach my hair and it would just fall out. So, and I don't really trust anybody else in this area, in the Maryland, D.C. area, just because I haven't really found a good hair stylist that, um uh like deals with color and natural hair all at the same time so that's that so i decided I was like, let me just get um some weed and i think it's pretty pretty big it gets bigger this hair can get really really big like like shaka khan hair big okay i'm this is a more controlled style because i had it in twists and one thing i do like about this hair when i don't twist my real hair it still matches flawlessly like it still just looks like my hair and that's what i like about this and it doesn't really shed it's it's i mean it's supposed to mimic type 4 hair so you are going to experience some shedding when you are combing it out but as opposed to like you walking around and you just seeing hair on your shoulder that's not going to happen the main reason why i purchased this weft or weave um basically it was because i wanted to experiment with color i mean it is subtle so you can't really see it as well but i just wanted something a little different and to see how i like it and i love it um this is how it looks straight out of the pack obviously not with the color on it so this is a color 1b but this is how it looks straight out of the pack i did have to bleach the hair first and then get um apply the color and i used manic panic two different colors of manic panic okay so like it was supposed to be more of this like blue color but it really only really shows like this like turquoise color even after i bleached and dyed it the hair still came out soft and delicious so if you want to get this hair i really 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 recommend it um it matches for type 4 hair perfectly um if you want something similar to here if you want something with less work because you do have to treat this hair like it is your own it does get dry it does get matted if you don't you know treat it like your own hair so it's you have to moisturize it daily or every other day you have to put moisturizer in it leave-in condition um and just treat it like it's your own hair if you want something different then they have different textures 3a 3b 3c 4a 4b 4c and you can get one bundle, two bundles, three bundles, four bundles, and they usually always have like a discount code. So I got three bundles of this hair, and but this is just something I like. Um, it looks like my hair, it feels like my hair, and it took color very well. So if you really want to check out this um, this brand, I truly recommend it. I'll put up all their Instagram, all of their website information down below. Um, I don't think I'm going to get a weave again. I don't think I'm a weave girl. This is like my third time um, actually getting a weave in my entire life. And I think I'm more of a wig type person. Maybe even like a U-part wig or something. Because I feel like I have a hat on my head and it's summertime. So I can't... It's hot already and I work out and then it gets hot and I'm like, uh... I don't really like weave and I feel like I'm always in my scalp like... Uh. So this is probably gonna be taken out very soon but I think I'm gonna try to invest in making a u-part wig or I don't think I don't think clip-ins are really efficient for me either because I don't feel like I have a real protective style when I have clip-ins I just feel like it's just an added on thing so I want to do more of a protective style where I don't have to really touch my hair or do much to my hair their prices range from like 104 to like 288 so it really just depends on what you're looking for i want to say relatively nicely priced for what you're getting like 
I got three bundles and I believe I paid like maybe 188 somewhere around that range when I paid like $60 to get this installed so that's really great especially when it comes to like three bundles or like kinky hair they're getting very expensive all these little brands because they're trying to jump on the little wagon they always have like a coupon code I know I use black girl magic before you get 20% 20, 20 off of the hair and that 20% off makes a huge huge difference I think it's very reasonably priced a lot of people can afford it and I think that's why it's done really well with their brand I'm pretty sure they still have that code if not I'm sure they have another code up on their site and yeah so I really encourage you guys to check them out did some really lazy twists and that's what you gonna get I don't know I mean if you want some really defined twist out I would suggest you take time to do your twists I just made some real lazy twists and called it a day because ain't nobody got time for that. I got things to do. I ain't got time to be spending two hours on my hair. No thank you. I'll check you guys in my next video. Bye.